Mario. You know, like, <laughs> you can get away with that. So we need to figure out which way, um, and I think maybe what we could do is, let's see, if we find which one of our corners is penetrating the object. So we'll, we'll test our corners first. And Okay, so like our bottom left corner is penetrating, and that's the only one that's penetrating. Therefore, we are going to maybe move in specific directions. So maybe we'll move up first. We'll see how far it takes to get out of this object. And the question would be, how do we figure out how far it's going to take to get out of that object? Well, we could take this x coordinate. So we could take the x coordinate, so x of the bottom left. So, like, let's call that. Yeah, we'll, we'll type this out. So, um, we, we could take our x coordinate and. The max y coordinate of either this one, like basically, if we're penetrating in this, that means that the y coordinate for one of theirs is higher. So basically, we want to move ourselves to the y, the greatest y coordinate along the axis here. So basically, like if this object was instead like this it wasn't a box you know because we're not just gonna have boxes for terrain in this game so what we're gonna want to do is we're gonna get we're, we're gonna want to get the y coordinate here and maybe move us up to here and we'll be able to get that based on getting the collision geometry of this object. I mean we could always like do something like cast a ray against this object from infinity, just straight down on it and see where that is. It's, it's probably the easiest way to do that. Just do a ray cast. So go through each um, hmm but this isn't always gonna work is it because if our corner is not penetrating if instead like you know we are kind of like this we're standing on something that's too big for Bitey to stand on. And neither of these two coordinates, um, these points, are are penetrating. What the hell do we even have for the results for this? We got this overlap result, which has the component, the item index. What the hell does this item index get us? The index of the overlapping item. Well, I mean that's another thing, right? You can you can try to remove those things, but I don't want to tell Adam that you know. All right, make make this game, but you know you have to make that a Lego blocks. You know, it's 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 some of those like if we can solve these problems easily without you know telling people you can't use that thing that they want to use, then it's just easier. 
And these are all, you know, actual solved problems. People have written games for all this crap before. I'm just too dumb to already know it. Just answering the phone. People want to go do things. But we, we have work to do. So what are we going to do? Um, we could do a few things. Um, so if we went through each of our, let me just, we just need rules. So we need to go through each um, of our corners for our bounding box. And if one of them collide, one of them is penetrating, then what we do is we cast a ray at the object we're penetrating from along that axis to get the to get the surface. And we move our object outside of the penetrating object by that, you know, to that point, to that collision point. Okay, so so what that'll do is if, like, we're penetrating this, we, we get moved up. If our, like, top right or something is colliding with something, we're going to move down. And, um, and then if we're, if we're, I guess that's another thing is, should we move down or should we move out? And I think the basic thing is if we can move up. What should be our rules for moving the box out? Like, in this case, it could be if we move ourselves down or should we move ourselves right or left sort of thing. And I think we could we could have some rules for that. We could just say uh, the rules for nudging are such: um, move up first, um, move right second, move left third, and move down fourth. So basically, what we would do is. We would try to nudge ourselves out of a of a wall, so we'd like try to move ourselves up. And if we couldn't move ourselves, you know, up, we'd try to move ourselves right. And if we moved ourselves to the right and we're still like colliding with something else, um, then we would try to move left. <laughs> In this case, that would fling us over to like the other side of this freaking platform. Um, And these rules actually need to be per square, per um, per corner of our box is what it looks like. So let's see. Hmm. Well, I'm not seeing anything on my stream anymore. Is it still working or is it a black box? I don't know. It says I'm offline. It says I'm online. So we'll see if it comes back.
it looks like the stream's having some major problems something like that so I'm just gonna start and stop the stream real quick here <laughs> 